and there's the station fly through you can see they're really looking forward to that inversion <laughs> Beginning of the day with a back row ride here on Phonix. first take on Phoenix is that, that was a really impressive roller coaster. It's not super fierce but yet the airtime that's there is aggressive. Uh, you've got two really whippy inversions in there. The drop was good at the back so I'm gonna go around do it at the front now. There is a little robot cutting the grass. How cool is that? Well, Phoenix absolutely delivers across the board. I think every single aspect of it kind of does what you'd expect or exceeds slightly what you'd expect. The drop's really cool. And I like the fact that the, the cable gets you up there super quickly. The stall loop is good. I think the vest restraints do limit the hang time a little when compared to like the Intamin and the Mac model. So I rode Nafiano Force at Emerald Park last week, which is also the coma. That interestingly didn't have the vest restraints and that had uh, inversions. So I'm hoping maybe that's a direction that the coma are heading in. That would be really cool to see. Then that second inversion is incredible. You get lots of like little bumps, which gives some really surprising ejector airtime. The inversion that heads you through the station, also really cool. I think it's the probably the second best of the inversions. And then just more airtime. It's it's a really, really good roller coaster this. And as I was saying before, I think, I think it could be Vacoma's best. It, it's certainly in that conversation with the likes of Fly. I can't think of many better than this. 